And welcome mga kasambahay to isang special segment from Geriatrica Philippines. We're with us, Dr. Tina Flor Cruz, ever, ever faithful and loyal guest natin this more, uh, this program natin na ito. Ang pag-uusapan naman natin, uric acid and how to get rid of accumulated uric acid in the blood. Or, ano bang uric acid at bakit siya masama sa katawan? So, uric acid is actually a waste product of the body. Usually, nalabas natin siya sa ihe. So, pagka mataas, tumataas yung level sa katawan, uh, naiipon siya, usually napupunta siya sa mga joints o kasukasuan. So, yun yung nagkakos ng pain sa mga arthritis na tinatawag. Yan ang tinatawag na gouty, gouty arthritis. arthritis. Gouty arthritis. Yeah. arthritis. Okay. So, it's a common... Nakaka, ano, no? Nakakadiri yung nakita natin sa video kanina, no? Hmm. May mga... Parang horror movie. Deformities <laughs> na siya. Oh, mga deformities. Oh. Usually, oh. mga uric, uh, uric acid na deposit siya sa mga elbows, sa yes. knees. Usually, sa mga fingers, sa big toe. Usually, okay. yun natin nakikita. So, it's very painful. It's swollen. Masakit pag hinawakan. Nakikita natin, mapula din siya. So, oh. yun, at ang onset niya, biglaan. So, yun ang naging so, problema. So, very acute pain. Very And it also pain. can accumulate in the kidneys and cause yes. kidney stones. Yes, so, kidney no? stones also. So, bukod sa damage sa mga joints, nasis, pwede ding masira ang bato. Ayun. So, Doktora, bakit nagpo-form ito? Ano yung pwedeng kainin ng mga tao na nagpo-form ito para maiwasan? Okay, it's been mentioned earlier, um, prevention is very important. Yes. So one of the things we have to avoid is alcohol right. and also eating a lot of internal organs. Yung mga liver, mga kilo, loob. lamang mga loob, yes. yes. tao, isaw, <laughs> sa mga, mga isaw. yung liver, okay, mga heart. <laughs> okay. Tapos uh, you also have to avoid some types of fish like yung mga nasa bagoong, okay, mm -hmm. mga nasa dilis, and then uh, tawilis, tuna, uh, tuna ganyan, and then oh, okay. yung mga lapad, very specific lang naman, but uh -huh. there are also some food items that we can eat in moderation. Sa mga vegetables, doktora, ano mm -hmm. naman yung naiwasan nila para hindi magkaroon ng gouty or Sa vegetables, kaunti lang naman yan. We can eat uh, any kind of vegetables, uh, but we have to eat in moderation yung asparagus, spinach, mushroom, yan. So, yung mga pwede nating eat. Yung favorite yung Dr. Philip kanina, bongo. Uh -oh. In moderation, so we oh. have to avoid that. So if you have a history of gout or kidney stones because of oh. uric acid, so avoid that. So avoid muna yan, yung mga oh. ganong kasi. Is there anything we can take, Ms. Yas, to help us? Uh, uh, Doktora, meron ba tayong pwedeng inumin ng mga uh, supplements para naman maiwasan? O may pangpatunaw ba dito sa mga gouts na ito o sa mga formations Usually, na ito? Uh, pag sa nagkakaroon tayo ng atake ng gout, uh, what happens is the, the doctor might uh, advise you to take anti, mga tawag natin anti-inflammatory mm -hmm. and also at the same time yung para matuna, para mawala ma-flush out din yung uric right. acid. But as mentioned earlier, natural is also very natural na mga items that we can take would be yung bromelain from pineapples and then their celery seed also. Ulit natin, Dr. Meron Bromley. tayong, uh, Dr. Chaya, meron tayong product okay. dito na isa sa mga paborito natin ito, ano? Uh, from Geriatrica, yung Urex. Doktora, can we discuss mm -hmm. kung ano yung dalawang components to? Ito yung bromelain and ah, celery okay. seed extract. Ano yung nagagawa ng bromelain sa... Uh, uric acid deposits. Yung bromelain, ma'am, uh, what it does is it prevents yung inflammation o yung na-mention nga natin, pamamaga ng mga mm. joints. Okay. And at the same time, it decre helps decrease yung uric acid sa blood. Ang um, celery seed naman, it helps prevent yung production naman ng uric ah, acid. Ah, okay. So, oh, okay. And this can help prevent gout. And, and even prevent treat. gout. Prevent. At kung meron ng gout, doktora, hmm. pwede ba itong matunaw? Pwede ba sila maibsan yung kanilang Yes, mga... opo. So, depending on the evaluation, of course, of the doctor, based on the history and the physical examination, oh. uh, usually they would advise to take that one to two capsules uh, twice a day. So, dapat pala talaga inumin na siya bago pa magkaroon ng gout? Yes, Alright. Yes. Especially oh. in patients who are prone to prone gout. To gout. Oh. Oh. Ayan, so bromelain and celery extract from Geriatrica. Ang brand Urex. natin is Urex. Saan ito nabibili? Okay. Oh. Usually, sa mga drugstores pa available. Ayun, sa mga major drugstores available nationwide. nationwide. And being a supplement, you can buy it over the counter. Over the counter. Over the counter. Don't need a prescription yeah. from a doctor yeah. to get it. But siguro, pag nag-persist in pain or gets worse, you'd you better yeah. see a doctor. We have to see a doctor, 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 doctor for yes. treatment. Okay. So, maraming maraming salamat, Dr. Kino Flor. Thank Flor, you too. very much. Very pleasure. See you again very much soon. Very much a pleasure to have you with us every Sunday. Also, see oh. you again oh. soon, ha? So, so, hindi lang kami ang gumagising na mga gatling Sunday. Halos every Sunday. Sama, Sama natin si Dr. Samahan tayo ng mga doctors yeah. natin. Uh, of course. Okay. Thank First, you. I'd like to thank our sponsors for the program. Thank, like to thank Mr. Walter, uh, co of Walter Bread. Also for Fiber C. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, thank you sa Fiber C, yung ating official vitamin C. Uh, you can call them at number 935-0486.
Uh, meron din sa 0925-883-5760 or sa Globe 0927-5441-786. Ayan. At sa lahat ng mga nangangailangan ng libre consultation, pwede po kayong tumuloy sa clinic ni Kuya every Monday to Friday, 5 a.m. ang registration sa 164 Congressional Avenue, Barangay Bahay, Toro, in Quezon City. Maraming salamat sa lahat ng doctors na tumulong sa ating thyroid clinic noong nakaraang Tuesday, si Elizabeth, si Jenny, at si Patty. Maraming po tayong nakita mga thyroid patients. Ayan, hello kay Doc Steph, at kay Lynn. And hello sa aking mina, mahal na kapatid, nandito ngayon sa studio at sa son ko. Hi, Ayon, and hi, babe. Okay, maraming salamat for joining us this morning. Magkita tayo mamayang hapon sa Makati UNTV Cup. Uh, hanggang sa susunod na linggo, mga kasambahay, be safe and stay healthy. I'll see you next week. Dito lamang sa Doctors, Doctors on TV. TV.